so here we discuss the syllabus of paper 1 which is common for all subjects this syllabus you can find online which is available on this link so here is the syllabus our teaching aptitude in teaching will be nature objectives characteristics and basic requirements learners characteristics factors affecting teaching methods of teaching teaching aids evaluation systems research aptitude is research meaning characteristics and types tips of research methods of research research ethics paper article workshop seminar conference and symposium thesis writing its characteristics and format a reading comprehension a passage is given and uh, the questions to be answered communication nature characteristics types barriers and effective classroom communication reasoning including mathematics like uh, aptitude the number series letter series codes relationships classifications and logical reasoning as understanding the structure of arguments, evaluating and distinguishing deductive and non-inductive reasoning, verbal analogies, word analogies, applied analogies, verbal classification, reasoning, logical diagrams, simple dramatic relationship, multi-dramatic relationship, Venn diagram, analytical reasoning. In data interpretation, it is sources, acquisition and interpretation of data, quantitative and qualitative data, graphical representation and mapping of data. Information and communication technology, meaning advantages, disadvantages, and uses, general abbreviations and terminology, basics of internet and mailing. For example, Web 2.0 is asked in the recent exam. People and environment, people and environment interaction, sources of pollution, pollutants, and their impact on human life, exploitation of natural and energy resources, natural hazards, and mitigation. Higher education system. Governance, Polity and Administration, Structure of the Institutions for Higher Learning and Research in India, Formal and Distance Education, Professional, Technical and General Education, Value Education, Governance, Polity and Administration, Concept Institutions and their Interactions. So you have seen that there are particularly 10 topics of our paper 1 and 50 questions you have to attempt. So you can expect that uh, there will be 5 questions from each topic. For example, I will take a question which is recently asked in January 2017 net exam. Positive classroom communication leads to coercion, submission, confrontation, persuasion. As you know that persuasion means the encouragement or motivation which leads to positive classroom communication. So correct option is 4. So most of the questions are very simple for paper 1 which is straightforward. So, some recommended books for paper 1 is uh, General Paper 1, UGC Net, JRF Slate, Teaching and Research Aptitude by Aryanth Publication. Another book is Truman's UGC Net, set by the Nika Publishing Company, other is M. Gagan and Sajid Kumar. CBC UGC Net, set JRF Paper 1, Teaching and Research Aptitude, KVS Madan from Pearson Education. You can take any one of the book out of three. And uh, this is an important thing, a website, online resources are available on this www.netugc.com which is free online CBC UGC net guidebook. So many important things you can find on this site. So here is the syllabus for paper 2 and paper 3, particularly for electronic science. So this is also online available on the link. Is given here. So, here is the electronic in electronic devices. The books is uh, integrated electronics by Milman Halkias. This uh, particular book covers uh, all the basic concepts, so it is more than enough for some numerical or conceptual things. Go to this book and for network analysis. D. Roy Chaudhary is the best book for analog circuits, Cetera Smith. This is also you can use for electronic devices. And another one is uh, electronic devices and circuits by JB Gupta. For digital circuits, the best book is Anand Kumar, the title Fundamentals of Digital Circuits. For microprocessor, Ramesh Gonkar is the best book. 
which is particularly for 8085 microprocessor for 8086 and other interfacing like 8254 this book by Sunil Mathur for C, C++ or Fortran the online resources a lot of online resources are available and uh, for book Yashwant Connector that is let us see for micro antenna wave propagation the antenna and wave propagation by KD Prasad for communication systems John G. Prokis for digital communication this is the best book and another book is uh, communication system by Simon Akins and modern digital analog communication system by VP Lati. Uh, power devices, optical source of for optical fibers, the gut geyser, optical fiber communication is the best book. And for power electronics, yes, Pembra. This is the second view option. Instrumentation and control systems for control system engineering by IJ Nagrath and M. Gopal is the best book. And for instrumentation and control systems, W. Bolton is the best book. So here also you will find that you have find that. Uh, there are 10 topics and uh, from these 10 topics you can expect that uh, 5, five, co five questions from each topic will be asked in the exam. So here is the analysis of number of questions asked in previous papers. You will observe that there is not uh, much variation in the number of questions uh, asked from the from different topics. So all topics are important for exam point of view. But here I would like to suggest you that uh, you should mainly focus on these topics. These are electronic devices, digital circuits, microprocessor, communication system and instrumentation. These are very important topics for some point of view. So in the last I would like to suggest to you uh, another book for last hour preparation or for revision purpose. A handbook on electronics and communication engineering by made easy publications so generally this book uh, cover uh, more than 80 percent uh, of the questions uh, uh, which you which comes in the exam and you will be able to solve this problem if you go thoroughly through this book so here is the category wise cutoff list of uh, which is in at december 2015 exam particularly highlighted for electronic science here you can see that 117 candidates uh, are qualified from general category in UGC net for uh, assistant professor as well as GRF and minimum cutoff percentage was 68.00% and 664 candidates uh, qualified for assistant professor only and their minimum cutoff percent marks was 62.86% this large number of uh, qualifying candidates indicates that uh, there is a great opportunity for the candidates to clear the UGC net exam so uh, you can go to UGC website to find the opening vacancies for assistant professor in uh, various institutions across India and also you can find the vacancy for GRF also and UGC provides 25,000 plus 30% HRA for two years and after that for three years it provides the 28,000 plus 30% HRA as a SRF senior research fellowship so that's all about from my side of UGC net thank you very much thanks for your kind attention go for it good luck friends please like and share share with your friends and uh, if you have any queries any doubt uh, any suggestions please mention it in the comment box and please subscribe my channel Praveen254888. Thanks a lot.